We also understand that being a young nation, we need to create job opportunities and better infrastructure. Both are linked with investments. Therefore, in recent years, there has been unprecedented focus on manufacturing and infrastructure. We have worked hard to promote manufacturing to create jobs for our youth. Investment through our Make in India initiative have been well supported by programs like Digital India and Skill India. Our focus also includes bringing our industrial infrastructure policies and practices to base global standards and to convert India into a global manufacturing hub. Cleaner energy and greener development. Zero defect and zero effect manufacturing. These are also our commitments. We have committed to the world to work towards reducing the effect of climate change. On the energy front, we are now the fifth largest producer of renewable energy in the world. We are fourth largest wind energy and fifth largest producer of solar energy. We are keen to scale up investments in next generation infrastructure, including roads, ports, railways, airports, telecom, digital networks, and energy. We are also investing heavily in our social, industrial, and agri-infrastructure to give better income and quality of life to our people. To give some examples in in four years, there has been maximum capacity addition and generation of electricity. For the first time, India has become a net exporter of electricity. We have distributed LED bulbs on a massive scale. This has resulted in a huge energy saving. We have installed transmission lines at an unprecedented pace. Our speed in road construction has almost doubled. We have done unprecedented capacity addition in major ports. Rural road connectivity is now 90%. The speed of setting up New rail lines, gauge conversion, doubling, and electrification of railway tracks has also doubled. We are debottlenecking execution of major projects on a regular basis through an online processes. Our public-private partnership regime for infrastructure has been made more investor friendly at 7.3%. At 7.3%, the average GDP growth over the entire term of our government has been the highest of any Indian government since 1991. At the same time, the average rate of inflation at 4.6% is the lowest for any Indian government since 1991 when India began its process of liberalization. 